Grand Rise and Grand Rising, ladies and gentlemen, kings and queens, spiritual warriors. How's everybody doing out there today? I hope everybody having a good, wonderful day out there. So that being said, y'all subscribe to the channel. Y'all hit that like button and leave a comment below at the bottom of the video. This is going to be a good topic right here. So buckle your seatbelts and get ready to draw the ride. So let's get right into it, shall we? Listen. You about to be the first millionaire in your family. You are about to break generational curses. Best believe that. Your blessing is coming. Be prepared for it. It's coming. Folks, my spiritual warriors out there, everybody who's listening, the reason why you was born into that family, that not that negativity toxic female of yours. I don't know who I'm speaking to, but it's somebody out there who got who's in a toxic family household. Or who was born into a toxicity family household. Even the case, I'm talking to you. You was born into that family for a reason. You were put in that family for a reason. A good reason as well. Cause you were born, I mean you were put here to break the generational curses in your family. From generation to generation to generation. Then when you came, God put that special type of chip in you. He put a gift in you to break the generational curse. He put you in the worst family tree. Cause he did it for a reason. He did it to make you, to make your family rich. Your family tree can be from a broken family tree to a rich family tree. All it takes is a simple belief. That's all it takes. It's a simple belief. A little salt. This much small, excuse me, this much small sauce of self-belief. That's all it takes. It's self-belief. That's all you need. This small a self-belief. Believe in yourself. Believe that you can do it. It's, it's going to be some days. It's not going to be easy. Trying to break the generational curse. It takes a lot of work to break that generational curse in the family. It does. It's not easy. You got to do some things that your family members didn't want to do or couldn't do. But God put it all on you, though. He knew who you was when you was in your mama's stomach. He knew this. That's why he put it in you for a reason. Because he knew you got the special talent. He knew you got the secret sauce. He knew you going to cook some up. Like you in the kitchen, cooking some up good. Then they're going to come up marvelous. It's going to come out fantastic. Man, I'm trying to tell y'all. Don't think bad of your family. Never do that. Because it's something in you that can change that whole family tree. <clears throat> y'all ain't thinking about that, then you? You're going to be the first one in your family. That's going to be a millionaire. Think about that. Whatever your passion is, whatever your goal is, whatever your dream is, invest in yourself. Put some work into it. And put some work behind that faith. And I guarantee you, you're going to make your whole family rich. Your whole family is going to be proud of you. They're going to be proud to say, that's my daughter, that's my son, that's my brother, that's my sister, that's my cousin, that's my kinfolk. You dig what I'm saying? This is what they're going to be saying. Make your family proud of you. Do not be a will of color sugar. Please don't. Because <laughs> your ancestors is looking down on you right now. Even God is watching you. And he know you got that special chip in you. So do not waste your gift or on nothing. 
put your head into them books, invest in yourself once again. Stay away from people who's not doing nothing with their life. And most importantly, most importantly, head to the gym. Re focus on your mind. And when you're in the gym, keep your mind strong. Not just for your body. Not for your arms and your muscles. Keep your mind strong as well. Because the mind is a terrible thing to waste, ladies and gentlemen. It is a terrible thing to waste. This right here. This is all you need. To break that generational curse. This is all you need. Your brain. Do not waste it on partying, drugs, S3X, none of that. Don't do it. You got work to do. You got some work that you, I mean, ugh. you got some work that you need to do. You got some curses that need to be break. And I believe in you. You can do it. And if I can do it, you can do it too. It's a lot of room at the top. I don't believe in that saying, oh, it's lonely at the top. I used to believe in that saying, but not anymore. There's plenty of room at the top. There could be a lot of winners at the top. But guess what? Do you believe in yourself? Do you believe you can break that curse? Do you believe you can be the first millionaire in your family? Yeah, you can do it. I know you can. But the question is, do you have what it takes? <laughs> do you have the self-confidence? Do you have the confidence in yourself? Do you? Hmm? I hope you do. Because guess what? I believe in you. I really do. And it only going to take a real one to understand this. If you ain't about that life, if you ain't no winner, guess what? This video ain't for you. This is for winners. This is for a winner who wants to win. This is for somebody that want to make their family rich. This is for somebody who want to break that generational curse in their family. And not only that, guess what? You gonna shock your whole hometown. You finna shock everybody. The next time they see you, that mouth gonna drop. They're not gonna believe it. You're gonna be the first one, not only in your family, but in your hometown. Excuse me. You're gonna be the first one that gonna make it. And you're gonna convince other people that they can do it too and they can make it out the city as well. It starts with one person. All it takes is just one, one person, just to put in the work and make it. And guess what? That one person can inspire the whole hometown. You may never know, but it all starts with you. You got what it takes, spiritual warrior, chosen one, star seed, king and queen. You have what it takes. Do not waste it. And one thing about wasted time, you cannot get it back. So if I were you, I'll start right now. Break that generational curse. You can do it. Put in that work. Find your purpose. Then put in the work. And with that being said, the results is going to slowly kick in. I don't care how long it takes. Slow process is still process. We got some work to do, spiritual warriors. Let's break these generational curses. And once again, we going all the way up. Ain't nothing gonna stop us. This is for the winners only. Generational curses only. No haters, no losers. Like I said in my last video, we're going to get our goals and blessings from God. These haters and these losers, the only goals they're going to get is they stick their finger up their nose. 
and dig out gold, aka that bogus. But us, up, up we go. Let's break these generation of curses, ladies and gentlemen. So with that being said, I'll catch y'all in the next video. And once again, subscribe to my channel, hit that like button, and leave a comment below in the bottom of the video. Oh, and another thing, make sure your notification is turned on. You won't regret it. I'll catch y'all sometime later on.